Hello, I am David W. Parker. This is Programming Today I Learned, WebGL series, episode 23, and we'll be looking at drawing points. So we'll jump right in here. Um, as you can like, see in the index, we have now have a UI utils, which is new, and it basically contains the code from the last episode where we we're taking a pixel input to GL coordinates. So this is basically the mouse down event uh, right here, and what we're doing is we're converting this to a negative one to one space within the x y range uh, for the canvas object and then we're exposing this globally so all this is familiar from last episode uh, if we look at the fragment we're just drawing white here and then the vertex is taking an a position in for different points and then drawing that in the point size so very simple now let's take a look at the index most of this is familiar and the same as normal um, a couple things to note here, after we get to the, uh, using the program, we're going to get the A position from attribute location here, pass that to our on mouse down event, after we're going to clear color and clear, if you go down, scroll down here to the on mouse down, we're going to go ahead and grab the location of the mouse down from the uh, UI utils, push the point onto a points array, which is here, globally, and then draw, which is the new function that takes in the A position passed in from above. So you can see here we're going to clear the cover, clear the cover, color buffer bit. Excuse me. We're going to find out the number of points. For every point, we're going to grab the vertex attrib three and go ahead and put in the x y position. And so this is basically passing into that. Um, vertex shader, the position that we want it drawn in, uh, that we can normally do, and we've done before, and then we're going to draw the points here. So what this ends up looking like is here, you can see here's our fresh little canvas object, and as we click, we are now drawing points all over. So that is the first application where we're actually getting some real interaction. Um, if you like what you saw today, please subscribe like this video, share it on social media if you will, and go to programmingtil.com and sign up for my newsletter. I hope you have a great one, thank you, and take it easy.